Welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red Ren Unlock My Hatchlings. Today is the day. We go inside here and we're going to take on the Leaf Four. Before we do anything, for one last time, we're going to take a look at our Pokemon. Carl, I know we did this like two episodes ago, but you know, I'm not gonna go as in in detail as before, you know, I'm just gonna quickly go over their moves. Carl learned Hyper Beam, that's all new. Um, stats are almost all in the hundreds except for special attack, which is amazing. Julith, she didn't learn anything off screen. I think she was learning something, but I decided against it. I think it might have been a mean look, I don't know, or that might have been on screen, who knows. Then we got Maggie, her her stats are actually pretty good too. And she didn't learn anything. I also want to say she was learning something, but I said no. No, she learned Rock Slide, and that was last time. Or before last time. Then we have Oscar. Nothing has changed about Oscar at all. He's actually, stat wise, probably one of the weakest. But he's still a really good Pokemon. Then we got Lori. Lori was learning Heal Bell, but I decided to keep Mill Drink instead. I think that would be a little more helpful. Plus, I bought some full heals. No need to worry about that too much. And then we have Glenn, who's been with us for a long time, him and Carl. And he doesn't learn anything off screen, but I'm going to teach him Thunderbolt right now and going to go through the rest of the TMs and decide what to do with those. So that's going to be the first thing we're going to do this episode. Let's go to our bag. And I have a Max Revive. I, need, I should sell that or throw it. I guess I don't really need money. But let's go up to our TM case. Alright, let's see what we got. We got Dragon Claw. That could be helpful. No one can learn it, so I <laughs> guess we're not going to worry about that one. What else? There's Blizzard. That could be good maybe on Oscar, but maybe I'll wait till we get to Lance because, you know, he could die. I'm gonna, I'll give that to whoever lives that far. Hopefully everyone lives that far, though. Thunderbolt, I'm definitely going to teach to Glenn. And we're going to actually really depend on him in the first battle. So, goodbye Spark, we've had you as long as I can remember. He never learned a single other electric move, besides Thunder Wave and Spark. It's okay, Glenn. I forgive you. Earthquake, that could be amazing. Gyarados could learn Earthquake, I just remember that actually. But it might be better on Oscar, because he's a ground type. So that would give stabs. So I'm actually gonna... I'm gonna no, I'm gonna hang on to it. Oh gosh. Should move now? Yes. Okay. Because, you know, that could be good on Lori, too. Psychic. I don't think anybody could learn Psychic. No, I was hoping Lori would be able to, but whatever. Fire Blast could be a potential for Maggie. I might wait on that one. Rock Tomb. Aerial Ace. That would be something I want to teach to Judah. Yes. Fin finally, we're getting rid of Peck. So let's get rid of that Peck move. One, two, and poof. Judith forgot pack and machine set. Judith learned that really nice. Yeah, I'm finally showing those animations. Cheap little animations for the fire of the green. And also we have overheat, so... I think that's all we're gonna do. Actually, steel wing could be a little helpful. It's a steel type move, right? Or is it comes flying? Steel. I could teach that to Judith, because we're gonna... Oh, no, I'm not even going to put her against Ice type, so never mind. No, we don't need Astonish. Astonish at this point in the game is not very helpful. Most of the time, it doesn't even cause flinching when I use it. It's a good move in the beginning of the game. But... Alright, guys, we're finally ready. I like how there's gym music in here. It kind of annoys me that there's gym music in here. I like the music outside the place, but we're going to lead with Glenn. And I activated the walk through walls cheat, so, because we can't go past her, because if you talk to her, I'm so sorry, but you waste your time coming here. Laura Lee of the late forward is absent. You know, it's after game stuff, but we can walk past her with the cheat, and then she's here. She lied to us. What a bitch. All right, first elite four. Welcome to the Pokemon League. I am Laura Lee of the elite four. No one can best me when it comes to icy Pokemon. Freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at mercy when they are frozen solid. Ha ha ha! 
are you ready? So she has ice types. I, I thought she had water types, but I think some of her Pokemon are ice and water, such as, you know, like Cloyster or Dugong. Dugong, here we go, see? And we don't have any fighting types, but, you know, I think we'll be okay with Thunderbolt. And I also don't have a lot of max elixirs. I have like two, and I think that's it. And I don't have, or I think they're max ethers. So I'm gonna try to not use too many hydro pumps. I'm gonna try to hold out on my PP as long as I can. And I just had hold and PP in the same sentence. It's weird. All right, and, and we're fighting a dugong, huh? But so far things are going good, and I think all the late four Pokemon. I don't think any of them go over 60, but I know the champion strongest is 61. But I think we'll be okay. All right, took out the first Pokemon. And here comes Cloyster. I'm gonna try to let Glenn handle all of this. I would love to cry, Cloyster. Sounds so cool. And so far, she has only girl Pokemon. That's sexist, even though. No, I have a variety. I have two girls? That sounds right. And Protect. You are one of those douchebags. Let's see how it is. And I did buy a lot of. A, th a few full stores and a lot of hybrid potions. Along with a good amount of full heals. Yeah, you can't use Protect multiple times in a row. I learned that in Emerald when I tried to fight the Fire Gem with my Pelipper and use Protect. I tried to use Protect twice in a row because I knew that's possible. Nope. Overheat died. That was a sad moment. Alright, slow, bro. We're just gonna Thunderbolt everything. See who who is there a ghost to leave for? I know there's this chick. There's Bruno, but I think he's the third. Lance, who's the second person after this girl? I don't even remember who it is. All right, Slowbro. Hopefully, we can one hit KO you. Ah, oh, barely survived. He's gonna use Surf. I'm not too worried. We're not even at half health yet. The hail stopped finally, thank you. Kinda saw that coming. Oh, slow bros, full of sword, sword health. Your bolt. And then I think I'm gonna try to hold back on using another thunderbolt and try to take it out with surf. And hopefully they'll do the job. So surf. Perfect, good job Glenn. I really don't want any deaths before the champion, like you said. And the Jinx. I'm, I'm gonna switch out for Jinx, and I think I'll go with Maggie. You know, she's fired. I'd be good against Ice. I just didn't want to use her against the other types of Pokemon because they're also part water, so it would have been bad for Maggie because she's quad eek against water. So. Flamethrower, take out that Jinx. Oh, lovely kiss. That Jinx is a lesbian. God, it put me to sleep, you asshole. Alright, hopefully you don't know any super crazy move. Ice punch? Okay, that's not bad. Doubt that'll do anything. Not very effective. Oh, Maggie woke up on the first turn. That was lucky. Set her on fire. Get out of here, Jinx. Alright. Ah, oh, you freaking bitch! That's a fast Jinx. Kissing my slug. Ice punch. As long as we don't get. Oh, we can't get frozen. We're asleep. You can't be frozen and asleep. Come on, wake up. I could use a full heal, but I know if I just do that, it's gonna use lovely kiss again. We're just gonna wait for Maggie to wake up, like right now, and use Flamethrower and finish off that Jinx. And is this her last Pokemon, or does she have one more? I was not paying attention. We took out Cloyster, Dugong. I forgot. Jinx. I think. Does she have a second Dugong? Oh, well. Oh, yeah, Lapras. You have a Lapras. That is scary. Glenn, come back out here and finish this. Here comes the Lapras. 
Oh, look at that beautiful beauty. So, all her Pokemon were girls. That is sexist. And that did a little over half health. Oh, Confuse Ray. I should have done that to you. Well, I'm trying to get out as soon as possible, because I feel like it's going to have something up its sleeve. It's probably going to know Perish Song. That's like a Lapras move. What do you have? Citrus Berry? Oh, that's cute. Come on. Beautiful. Do some good. Come on. Did it survive just a little sliver? Oh, you bitch. Then watch, I'm gonna get paralyzed from Bonus Sun. Oh no, we're good. But she's gonna use a full restore, of course. It's a boss battle. It wouldn't it wouldn't be an elite four battle if there was no full restores involved. Alright, it's not out of confusion, that's good. We're gonna end up using all our Thunderbolts in this one Elite Four member. Alright, one more should do it. Oh and we stroke stroke? We struck first. Struck like lightning. There we go. Laurely is done. Level up. Good job, Glenn. Your first one to level 56. Things shouldn't be this way. You're better than I thought. Go on ahead. You only got a taste of the Pokemon League's power. All right, so now it's heal. With our fancy dancy hyper potions, I got 30 of them. There's one on you. And then one on Maggie. And that should be good. Now, I totally forgot who the next person is, so let's go find out. Oh, is it Bruno now? All right, if it's Bruno, then we're gonna put our flying type up first and hope Hope to God that she can handle this. You know, she is also part dark type, so fighting moves do 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 <laughs> do some damage on her. But it's Aero Ace does 60, Fly does 70. So Aero Ace never misses and slightly weaker than Fly. So I don't know. We'll see what we do. I am Bruno of the Elite Four. Throughout rigorous training, people and Pokemon can become stronger without limit. I've lived and trained with my fighting Pokemon, and that'll never change. Hatched. I don't know how I knew your name, but we will grind you down with our superior power. Hoo-ha! Alright, Bruno. I don't fear you. Oh, he looks so badass. His, his name should be Broly. He should just be Bro- Oh, fuck! He has rock types, not fighting types. How did I get this mixed up? <laughs> I could have sworn he had fighting types. All right, we'll throw Carl out. I had no idea. I could have sworn he had fighting types. All right, we got a giant water snake against the giant rock snake. Rock to oh we we're weak against rock. Oh, I didn't do that much. I'm not worried. Let's go lower our speed. Oh, Carl tried to learn Dragon Dance, but I figured he didn't need that. On surf, yeah. So Onyx is ground rock. I wasn't too worried. <laughs> Hopefully, he has like a graveler next. That'd be cool. No, it doesn't know like explosion. Oh, hit my chain. Oh, see, I'm not crazy. Okay, I might be crazy, but I knew he had fighting types. See, just Onyx was the only exception. And this has a third type that I was not aware of. All right, hit my. I'm not too afraid of hit my chain, even though it knows it probably knows Thunder Punch because. The elemental punches are special in this game, and Hitmonchan is completely physical, so all the elemental punches just freaking suck on Hitmonchan. But, wow, he's gonna go for Thunder Punch. No, he went for Rock Tomb. Okay, that was scary then. Come on, Fly, please tell me you'll take it down one hit. Oh, dude, this is amazing. You know, you got Attack, Stab, and the Sharp Beak, so her flying moves are amazing. And, oh, a matchup. Alright, Judith. This is your moment to shine. You're gonna soar to victory. If you could one-shot this Machamp, that'll be so... It's using Scary Face. It's big giant Machamp, you're scary enough, and then you're just making scary faces. That's silly. Come on, Judith. 
Okay, that was not a one shot, but you did good amount of damage. Oh, it's bulking up. So attack rose, does defense go up with it? Yes, it does. Okay. And he has a citrus berry, but one more fly should be able to take him down. If he uses bulk up a second time, though, it might not. We're going to find out. Oh, use cross jump. Yes, come on, Judith. Wow. Survive the red health. Cross shop, here it comes. Gonna break our neck. He broke our neck. Oh no. Oh. I knew the day would come when Judith would die. I knew the day was gonna come. I. Ah. Oh. There, there's her. There's her freaking sprite waving us goodbye. I knew the day would come when she'd die, but. You know what? I didn't expect Judith to get all the way to the Elite Four. I'm, I never saw that coming. But okay, so let's go over our Pokemon. Uh, Lori, no, not for Machamp. Oscar, no, not for Machamp. Maggie, no, for not for Machamp. So we're gonna have to go with Glenn or Carl. I'm gonna go with Carl because he's part Flying type, so Flying will do less damage on him. If only Carl could learn Fly. All right, we're gonna use Surf. Uh, and then, Judith took him down to red health, barely any health, and then four sword right there. He's level 56, holy crap. Drown him. Surf. That did not do as much. How much will Dragon Rage do? 40 HP, I know that. Compared to Surf. Let's find out. A little less, so I think we'll stick with Surf. As long as this thing doesn't know like a super powerful rock move. Which I think the strongest one in here might be like Rock Blast. But holy crap, critical cross chop. Not very effective. Well it did a lot anyways. Surf. I, I should heal. If he gets another critical, maybe not even a critical, and Carl could go down. So we're gonna use a super hyper potion. Oh, and his cross shot missed. That would have been a good time to attack, actually. Surf. Alright. We also lost our only dark type, and Carl. I got rid of Bite on Carl, so when we fight that Alex Zam at the champion, I don't know how we're gonna handle that. I'll probably end up using Carl anyways. We have Hyper Beam on him and Hydro Pump. Hit on Lee! Crap, how am I gonna take out fighting types? You know what, Carl? Stay out here, I guess. You're, you're, you're the only flying type on our team. There's no flying moves. I bet you anything if there was a drag. Wait, there was a dragon type in Generation 1. Carl, why are you not part dragon type? You should definitely be water and dragon. Alright, this hit one leaves gonna be troublesome. He's another hyper potion. Mega kick. Is that gonna hurt? Yep, that hurt. Our surf. Mega kick missed. Gotta love the low accuracy on Mega Punch and Mega Kick. Except when you're using them, of course, but you know. Most of the time, it's being used against me, and it missed again! Come on, Carl. Please take it down this one last surf. It's gonna survive with Red Sliver. Oh no, it went down. Good job. Hit Mon Lee. His eyeliner. Guy liner. Here comes an Onyx, we could handle that. And this is the last Pokemon. Began and ended with an Onyx. Surf. Oh no, it's double edged. That's scary. Surf. One hit KO. Second elite four members down. So we finished half of them in 19 minutes. So that's pretty good. Why? How could I lose? I killed my baby bird. My job is done. Go face your next challenge. I like how he turns away. That is disrespectful. Well, let's heal our Pokemon, except for, of course, our dead one, Judith. Very, very sad. Sad day. <sighs> okay, so who's next? Hopefully not Psychic. Alright, we'll just put Carl up. 
I don't know who's next at all. Fuck you, Bruno. I just walked through that door. Or that wall. Okay, so it's Ghost. Dark beats Ghost? I don't think so. Maybe not. What am I gonna do here? I'm gonna save. I want. I'm gonna. I have to save Oscar for Dragon. So Maggie, maybe. All right. I am Agatha of the Leap Four. I heard Oaks taking a lot of interest in you, child. That old duff was once tough and handsome. Hmm. But that was decades ago. He's a shadow of his former self. Now, he just wants to fiddle with his Pokedex. He's wrong. Pokemon are for battling. Hatched, I'll show you all real trainer battles. I don't even know how I know your name. Alright, Agatha. Oh, god, her sprite is ugly. Ugly. Didn't even know she was partly blonde. Yeah, I totally forgot about this chick. I don't know how. She takes over, like, Giovanni's gym in the anime. So, she has Gengar. Let's get her. Oh, I don't... I... Uh, this place is scary. We need Judith for this place, but too late for that. Will Yawn work even though it's a normal type move? I don't think it will. We're just gonna use Rock Slide. Oh, and it's using Double Team. You're gonna be annoying. Hey, we can use Aerial Ace. Oh, wait, no. Our Pokemon with Aerial Ace died. Use Faint Attack. Oh, wait, no. Our Pokemon with that died. Oh, this, this Gengar is just spamming Double Team. Great. This Gengar is gonna be the death of us. Ah, come on. Now it's using this Gengar is gonna be annoying. Mm. Come on, Megan. Fight to confusion. There we go. Finally hit him something. If we could get a burn on it, that would be amazing. All right. Use another Shadow Punch. Great. I could probably just switch to Lori and use Rollout. Rilla has low accuracy though, but Lori can get hit by ghost type moves. So that could be useful. She's rock slide while it heals. If rock slide could hit, that'll probably do some good damage. Rock slide's not gonna hit. Oh, you know fucking toxic, you bitch! Alright, no, we can fight toxic. Ah, fucking rock slide keeps missing. And you're using more double teams. Rock Slide, why won't you hit? Oh crap, I did not mean to hit Rock Slide again. Alright, we need to switch Maggie out now. Oh. Alright. Send Glennon. Double team. This Gengar is going. Alright, let's try to hit if I confuse right. Speeding up is because we're we can't hit it and we're confused, so I need to speed up a little so stuff could happen. There we go. All right, while well, it's confused, that's our time to hit it. We became confused. All right, we're hydro pumping this one. This could even hit it. Snapped out confusion. Good job, Glenn. Fuck. And then he's confused around this one. Hydro pump's missing. Getting punched, hydro pump's missing, getting confused, we're punching ourselves, and now we're poisoned. And this is the her first Pokemon. It's annoying ass Gengar. We have one that's hydro pump. Finally it hits! Did massive damage, but not enough. Oh if she fucking heals. God Glenn! 4 HP, okay. Full restore. Alright, Glenn. I believe in you. You're not gonna die that easily. Not to a Gengar. That'll be... That'll be the day. Come on. I'm so tired of this Gengar. It's being a fucking douche. Quit hitting yourself. Alright, heal again of a hyper potion this time. Oh, critical hit. That would've hurt. Glad we healed. There we go, hit it. There we go. Fuck that Gengar. 
fucking a million times over. That thing was the devil. And I believe she has two Gengars, actually. So, hopefully not. Okay, Golbat. You could stay in for that. I'll just hit a Thunderbolt. Poison Fang. That's gonna poison me. I just, yeah, see? It's just my luck for that to happen. Alright, hopefully this Golbat goes out with one Thunderbolt. Okay, good. Good job, Glenn. And Arbok. Okay. Yeah, you know what? Earthquake on Oscar should have been something I should have done. Or at least on Carl. I, I'm just waiting because if Oscar dies, I'm going to teach it to Carl. Carl's going to make it to the end for sure. Um, what's she throwing out again? Arbok. Let's go with Lori. I think Lorica had on Arbok. We're gonna get poisoned, I just know that. I don't even know if she has a type. You know, I figured she'd be ghost type, but you know, she has an Arbok. That's not a ghost type. And just like Bruno, he had like rock types and fighting types. But we're gonna go Body Slam. Sledge Bomb. It's gonna poison us. Oh crap, critical hit. Well, I'm happy that was a critical hit, because if it wasn't, that did have damage. But, I don't expect... Oh, Paralysis? Yes, thank you, Lori. You're, you're doing something right. Alright, as long as it's not a critical hit, Lori should survive. Alright, um... I'm gonna heal. I guess I could've... I could use Milk Drink. We're faster anyways. And, she's paralyzed. So she... There's no way she's going first. Unless Arbok can do Quick Attack, which, that's impossible. Alright, let's hit it with another Body Slam. Actually, I should've stomped it. Because now it's just gonna heal that it's red health. Oh no! She doesn't care for her Arbok. She saw it wasn't doing any major damage. There we go. Good job, Lori. Another Gengar. Carl, you're gonna handle this one. Glenn, Glenn took like two poisons, multiple punches to the face. He survived to 4 HP at one point, so I think Glenn deserves a, a break from this battle. Level 58 Gengar, that is scary. That's you. Hyper Beam, I'll it. Before it. Oh, your channel player's asleep. Too bad. Hey, we, oh, we had this Nami ability. Oh, wait, our one Pokemon of that died. It's like the perfect Pokemon for this battle, just had to die right before it. I thought I could have sworn Bruno was third. That might be in Soul Silver. That's probably when he's third. Uh, now we're asleep. If we could hit it with one more Hydro Pump. And it better not start spamming double team. Like that first one. I don't think this one's an annoying one. This one's more of a, I'm gonna fuck your day up. That one's just like, I'm gonna be fucking annoying. Come on, Carl. You do it, Carl. Good job, Carl. <sighs> 3,000 experience, level 56. Carl's the second one to get that level. Him and Glenn. Oh, she has one more Pokemon? I thought that Gengar was the last one. Alright, now's a good time for Oscar. Oscar can handle a Haunter. Oscar, Haunter. See, they rhyme. It's meant to be. This battle is destiny. Hopefully the outcome is on our side. Rock Slide. He fucking needs hypnosis. We set the female Haunter. Oh, use Curse. That's not good. So now we're cursed and asleep. Oh! Fuck! Mean look. Well, we can't switch. Alright, I'm gonna have to use a full restore. That curse is gonna fuck my day up. Oh! Good time to freaking heal. Use Dream Eater. Hit a rock slide. Take that hunter out. Okay, we're good. Oscar, I got scared there for a second. Can't lose you before the dragon, dude. Dragon Dude Lance, he has a name. Oh my, you're stopped in special child. Fuck you, Agatha. You win. I see what old Duff does season you now. I have nothing else to say. Run along now, child. Oh god. That was a scary battle. We had no severe <laughs> we have two poison Pokemon. Um Okay, let's just heal five potions. 
So last up is Lance before the champion. So this is going to be a pretty long episode. I guess I could save Lance for next episode with the champion, but I want to just take the champion out in one episode. I want him to have his own episode. Let's get these antidotes. There we go. Alright, we're good. Uh, Glenn doesn't have any hydro pumps, so should I do something about that? I feel I should. We have two max either full or selected PB for wood. I, I think I need to save that. I feel I should save that, so. Um. What am I gonna. F I don't know what Lance starts off with. I don't even know his team. He, I'm pretty sure he has two Dragonites. He, I know he has a Dragonair, right? He might have two of those, and he probably has some other bullshit Pokemon. So, we're going in there. Oh shit, it just forces us into Lance's room? We're being controlled by a demon right now. I am not touching anything. Lance is discovered the demon type Pokemon. Okay, good. We don't have to fight him right away. <laughs> Let's go. Ah, I've heard about you. Hatched. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance, the Dragon Trainer. Or Lance for short. You know that dragons are mythical Pokemon. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible until 2013 when the Fairy Nation attacked. There's no being clever with them. Well, are you ready to lose? Your league challenge ends with me hatched. Hopefully that doesn't become true. And oh, look at Lance, such a badass. Here he is. That Elite Four Lance would like to battle. Oh, he has a Gyarados. I told you you'd have a bullshit Pokemon. All right, Lori, please tell me. Ah, oh, intimidate, fuck it. I am, <laughs> I'm gonna regret this. I'm going to roll out. Because it'll it's super effective for one, and if he doesn't do any major damage to us, we could build that roller out. He might. T oh, Dragon Rage. How many Dragon Rages can we take? We could take a good amount. Roll out. Super effective. No. Nope. Yeah, keep using Bite, and don't make me flinch, and it'll be awesome for me. Come on. One more roll out. One more roll out. Dragon Rage. Lori, I swear, if you fucking miss. If you freaking miss. Okay, I thought she missed for a second. <sighs> Gyarados is done. That was scary. I don't like finding Gyar Gyarados. I've always hated Gyarados until a Pokemon by the name of Sigilith came around. Then I started hating that more. Aerodactyl. Huh, <laughs> I'm not scared of you. Throw Glen out. Oscar's gonna be our secret weapon. Shit to Oscar Blizzard. I forgot about that. It's okay. We have Icy Wind. Powder Snow. We have Powder Snow. No, we have... Do we? Is it Powder Snow or Icy Wind? We have one. We have some sort of Ice Wind that does damage. Ah, oh, really? I should have took him out. Oh, well, he's gonna heal. We're gonna hit it again. We might even get lucky and critical hit it. i will just go down one hit. Level 58 Aerodactyl. I thought 55 would have been over leveled, but I'm, I'm definitely glad I went 55 because we're probably just right there perfectly where we should be. Ancient power, please don't hurt me. Okay, finish that Aerodactyl off. So, Gyarados Aerodactyl. you pretty sure he has two Dragonites, so then he probably has a Dragonite. So, he's gonna throw one of Dragonites or the Dragonair out. Dragonair, okay. Do I wanna fight? Dragonair with Hollow Swine or keep Glenn out? I'm gonna keep Glenn out. I'm gonna hope this goes good. I'm gonna go with a Surf. It's level 54, so we're two levels ahead of it. Surf did not do much, not very effective at all. Dragon Rage. I think I'm gonna let Glenn handle this Dragonair. Now let's get Hyper Potion. So, okay, so so far Elite Four is going good. Only one loss. It was probably a loss that was expected for Elite Four. I didn't think that cross chop would be a one hit KO, but uh, I'll take you for Confuse Ray. Because that could. Oh, Safeguard. Okay. I see how it is. Outrage. Ouch. Outrage. That's what it should be. 
an electrocute you and hope that does something. We need to say we need to have a thunderbolt for the champion to pidge you out. So uh, I'm only gonna probably use one more thunderbolt maybe. That or I just won't heal his hydro pump. Who knows? Oh, it's confused on its own. We don't need a confuse ray. All right, let's hit it with a surf. Yep, yeah, we don't have any hydro. Surf and hope it hits itself too. I think we'll be okay. Better not freaking heal. It should hit itself and do some major damage. Okay, hit itself, do some major damage. So we have one slip. Oh! Goodbye, Dragonair. Okay, now we just got the two Dragonites. That's the scary part. Glenn Grindle 57. Oh, he has two Dragonair. Okay, because that's Johto when he gets two Dragonites, because I guess they, one of his evolved. Uh, Glenn, you already had to take down one, so let's get you out of there. And we'll let Oscar handle this one. Alright, Oscar, this is your moment. Ever since I caught you east of Cerulean City, you've been, you were made for this moment. Okay, it was Powder Snow. Outrage, don't do too much. Just do a little bit. Oh, critical hit. Okay. I'm happy that was a critical hit. Because if that just did half health, over half health on its own, ooh, that would have been in trouble. Nice. If we could freeze it, that'd be one. Oh. <laughs> Not that lucky today. Heal. Hey, look, we're having two 40 man episodes in a row. Rage. Oh yeah, that does nothing. Well, it does something, but not as much as I thought it would. I don't want to heal again. I didn't lose that much health. Pro Dragoner is confused. It hurt itself in its confusion. Powder Snow. Come on, Oscar. We, you could use one of your lucky critical hits you keep getting. It barely survived the slip. It's gonna heal. No, that's fine. You know, you probably need the help. Lance. If we could freeze it, that'd be super cool. Super effective. I don't care about. Oh, I don't think we can freeze it. But safeguard up. It's okay. This thing's gonna go out in one or two more hits. Hopefully one. No, it's gonna be two. Hyper Beam? You just pulled that out of your ass like freaking Claire's Kingdra. Except hers missed. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Did not do too much. Alright, one last Pokemon. One more. Good job, Oscar. The Dragonite of Death. Hopefully, this thing doesn't know any water or fire type moves. Probably does. I'm just gonna hope it doesn't. Let's heal Oscar. I should have just healed Oscar after that hyper beam. Well, actually, I didn't know there's a hyper beam coming. Oh, here's Outrage. It's probably gonna do way more than Dragonair. Oh, that did health. Okay. We're gonna. We're just gonna wait it out until it gets confused. Because. If it gets confused, then I'll get our chance to attack it if it gets confused. No longer protected by safeguard. Confused. That one did not do health. Or, um, take us down to half health. That's what I was trying to say. English is hard. Okay, hurt itself. Perfect. Powder Snow, Freeze, that would be the most amazing thing to happen in this battle right now. Or a critical hit, I'll have either one. You could decide game. Oh, we got neither. Instead it gave Dragonite a berry. Pull the valve of its ass. <laughs> Better double check make sure it's berry. Hurt itself again, okay. Powder Snow, critical, freeze, any, please. Come on. 
Oh, it's not doubt. It's gonna use out outrage and kill me. It's gonna use outrage and kill me. I don't want to look. It's gonna use outrage and kill me. I'm looking. 17 HP, Oscar. You are amazing. Oscar is a clutch. Go, Oscar. I love you. And to believe, I doubted you when I first caught you. And look how far you've come. You've come from a little swine nub that was disappointing to an os to an Oscar to a pile of swine that is extremely amazing. Thank you, Oscar. We just got 6,000 bucks. That's super great. I still can't believe my dragons lost to you, Atch. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or you could have been, but you have one more challenge left. There is one more trainer to face. His name is... NELSON! <laughs> oh, sorry. He beat the late four before you, literally two minutes ago. He just he just walked in, killed me, and then you walked in afterwards, so um, a little late. Anyways, he is the real Pokemon League champion. I am shocked to hear of this. This means next episode will be wrapping up Fire Red. I'll see you guys then. Follow me on Twitter for updates on my channel.